Welcome back to the YouTube marketing series. My name is Phil and I'm with Phil Mora. Today we're learning how to use Google Trends and Google's Keyword Planner to find specific keywords that will help you optimize your YouTube videos. So let's start out with Google Trends, a great way to find trending topics to create videos on. Here we're in Google Trends, so Google dot com slash trends and you can see some of the trending topics from today I'm recording this on October 11th 2016 lots of stuff happening in the world in the US in particular presidential debate the election is coming up hurricane Matthew just hit the MLB playoffs are happening so you can see some of the top trending topics right here and then below you can see specific stories if you are creating a channel that's just about trending topics about recent happenings you can find things to talk about right here these are things that people are searching for so you know that people potentially will be finding your video if you're creating videos about these topics that are interesting and unique this also means there's so much content about this stuff. There's a lot of people, websites, writing stories, creating videos, and everything about these different topics. So you gotta make sure that yours is unique and stands out. Another way to actually look at this is by looking at the categories. So you can search under say business, and you can see specific business topics that are trending right now. And you can see a graph of how popular or what the trending graph looks like for any of these. So hopefully that gave you some great ideas about how to find topics to create videos about. Now let's use Google Keyword Planner to find keywords that you'll use in optimizing your videos. So let's move into the Google Keyword Planner. So this is actually an AdWords product. So if you search for Google Keyword Planner, you will see the first result is Google AdWords Keyword Planner. AdWords.Google.com slash Keyword Planner is where you want to go. And you'll have to sign in with your AdWords account, which means you'll have to sign up for AdWords with your Google account to check it out. So compared to Google Trends, the Keyword Planner is more of a tool that I use to figure out what specific keywords to use in my titles. So how I use it is under Find New Keywords and Get Search Volume Data, I'll click the Search for New Keywords using a phrase, website, or category. So say we're using this example of the Sennheiser HD 380 Pro. So I'm just going to type that in, Sennheiser HD 380 Pro. And then I'm just going to say, get ideas. I'm going to leave all of this stuff the same and just say, get ideas. You can see here how many people are specifically searching for this keyword. So between one to 10,000, which is pretty good. The competition is high though, meaning that there's a lot of other people that have articles or videos about this topic. And then you can also see what other keywords people are searching for in relation to this. I can see here that Sennheiser 3 HD 380 Pro review all those keywords. It's not as popular, but there's less competition. So doing a video and an article, which I recommend when you're creating YouTube videos is to combine it with an article with the same keywords might be a good idea. You can also see specific keyword searches related. So Sennheiser headphones, seeing just that this is a term that has a, a decent amount of searches per month would affirm to me that I should make this video. So now you know how to find trending topics and how to find keywords related to the topics that you're creating your videos on. Let's put it into practice by optimizing our YouTube videos. That's coming up in the next video in this series.